Mm. All right, more uh, more rent. I'm loving the rent. Maybe I should try to play the loot again, level two, and see how much money I can make now. Oh, he got me a present. Cool. J Org the Bard. J Org, it's probably George. Right, I want to go do a loop, a loop job and see how much more money I can make now that I got level two. What the hell? Where am I? I don't recognize this area. How the fuck did I get over here? <laughs> I got here by complete accident. There we go. See what I can do. Go on, I ain't asking for much. Well, I'm customers have been good to, to me, so I'm good to them. That's all right. Sweet. Oh, kids are coming. Kids are coming to watch. Yay! Yay! My parents were beggars, but on a street that wasn't nearly this nice. Sweet, I can make a lot of money doing this, yeah. I think. Yeah, I'm a minstrel. Kill all the people. Woo, all if you're right. going around stuck on anything, kill everyone. Know. Everyone deserves to die Everyone's now. <laughs> That's great. Have some money. No, 162, it maxed out there. Multiplier. Oh, oh, yeah. oh no, 180. There you go. 180 is the max. Yep, 180. <laughs> I'm about to beat Rambo! Eat your heart out, Rambo! I'm a minstrel! Yeah! <laughs> I do this for like an hour and have like a shit ton of money. Yeah! But of course, it's probably not a lot in the long run. It's probably all about real estate in this game, I bet. Buying and selling houses. I should probably go buy another couple houses is what I should do. That way I have constant income, always pouring in. Alright, yeah. Well, I goofed that one up. <laughs> I should have learned to trade. Other than begging, I mean. Other than begging. Yes, a trade other than begging might have paid off. Oh, that's your hat. Whoa, holy shit. All these plays of existence are cool. Hi, 
pie maker. I already did that. My goods are the cheapest. I'm a pie really maker. They are. As long as you have enough gold not to go hungry, that's enough, isn't it? What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> He's <laughs> dancing with him. <laughs> yeah. Ali. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, Why did he do that? Oh. This will be a treat for the eyes. I like that top you're wearing. Really suits back. you. My God. That was scary shit. He picked them up. I sell the best items in all Brightwood. See, how do I sell stuff? I can't. I have all those gems. I have no idea how to sell them. I don't even know how to look at my inventory. The game didn't teach you shit. I'm gonna see if I can go buy another house. Rent it out. Come on, little doggy. Well, oh, this is the district I can buy houses in, right? How much is this one? Twenty-four I'll buy it and rent it out. House of Slats. Yes. And let's see. Repair it. Yes. Sweet. All right, cool. I got two houses I'm getting constant income from. That's what I like. I'm gonna keep doing that over and over until I uh, have a constant stream of money. I don't have to worry about it anymore. Back to the bar. Can I just get some service? Ah, here he is. We were just talking about you. Indeed, we have made a toast to your stupendous feat in ridding Miss Peak of Saker and his men. They have been a source of great distress for some time. Nobody will be more pleased than Sabine. Hmm. His dwellers might find some peace now. Of course, nobody has suffered more than they. I've been telling Samuel here about the terrible situation they're in. Fuck is this guy? He followed me in. He may be able to. Fuck out of here. Yes, well, uh, perhaps, uh, I mean, of course. Uh, the thing is, as I was just explaining to Sir Walter, uh, Brightwall has no overabundance of resources itself. The King's levies are rather steep, and we face shortages more often than is comfortable. But? But, were you to improve things around Brightwall, uh, the people would be most grateful. <laughs> and when people are grateful, they're... Also charitable. I'm sure they would find it in their hearts to send aid to those poor people. There you have it. The way I see it, you will need all the followers you can get if you're going to lead a successful rebellion. What better time to start? I heartily agree with Sir Walter. Pardon me for overhearing. As it happens, I've learned of a promising method for amassing followers. I got more gifts. If you'll return to the sanctuary at your earliest convenience, I, more gifts. I can show you what I mean. Okay. I just got a shit ton of gifts, so maybe it's all the stuff I was supposed to get ah, earlier and didn't now, get yet. The book says there is an additional rather amazing capability about the sanctuary's map table. It can help you find people who are in need of a hero. That's great. Fuck you. Get my gifts. Hunter's Lodge Deed. Hunter's Lodge. Oh, that's right. That's for the for buying the collector's edition. Okay. Ah, the Channeler Sword. That's what I got for Best Buy pre-order. The fan gave me. The Crystal Tattoo Set. Sweet. And the Clockwork Tattoo Set. I should go check all those out. Um, let's check out the Channeler Sword first. See what it looks like. There it is, we're at 8200, damage of 24. It's gonna be, yeah, it's probably gonna be way better because it's gonna be faster than the hammer. Alright, let's get that. Equip that baby. 
Alright, now let's go check out those tattoos. Facial hair, tattoo set. There's the crystal tattoo set. There's the clockwork tattoo set. What, but which one does, like, what do they do? That's the Highlander tattoo set. Do any of them do anything special? How do you find out? Let's see. Does it tell you anything? Okay. Yes. I want to see what the tattoos look like on them. Look at that. There's some kind of crystals on them, but what is the point? Do they do anything? The game doesn't really explain that, does it? Not really. On this clockwork tattoo set. He gets on his eye. He looks so stupid. <laughs> yeah, let's give him the clockwork tattoo set. He got clockwork all over his body. He looks like an idiot. And then let's give him. He only has that one hairstyle, so there's no makeup uh, styles. Facial hair, we'll give it, we'll keep the goatee. Let's keep him with the Highlander for now. I think the Highlander is the coolest one right now. We'll keep him in that. And I've got a Chandler sword, so. I wonder if this means I get, the, uh, if, I don't know if I got the dog breed. Let's see if I got the dog breed, which is supposed to be the last one. Nope, I didn't get it yet. I'm supposed to be able to change him to a boxer, but I have not gotten it yet. Alright, now what was I supposed to do with this fucking map? Tell me. Let's see. An excellent way to gain followers is by helping villagers in need. Take a closer look at Brightwall and I will explain more. Okay. You can now see the villagers in need. Aha! You can also see how many followers you must amass to impress Samuel and the people of Brightwall. Okay. Select a villager to help. By doing so, you will gain the respect and loyalty of others in the region. Bernard and Patsy's chickens have run amok. The glowing trail will now follow you. Alright, this is how you select quests. Okay. Yes. <laughs> This way, it says. Nope. No. This way. No. This way. Holy shit. The game couldn't decide. The game still can't decide. What am I doing? What's going on? Oh! I didn't mean to do that. Shit. <laughs> Very good. I'm totally lost. Like, the glowing path doesn't work. Look, the glowing path is not working. Nice. <laughs> I'm doing it right now. Nothing's happening at all. <laughs> Fucking kick the shit out of it. Kick into the river. You go in the river. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Very good. Very right to the river. <laughs> Very good. What is the mission I'm doing? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, I'm tickled. Oh, now the path's working. <laughs> it wasn't working at all. Now the path fixed itself. Wow, dude. Nice game bug. Alright, let's see what this mission is.